welcome back. Why computers go to the doctors? Because they get subscribe. 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 Thank you. So, Charlie, what's been going on? <laughs> well, I've got a new career. As a crash test dummy? <laughs> Writing songs for little kids. Really? Yeah. Turns out, immature minds respond to me. <laughs> Sounds about right. Uh, uh, let's see, what else? Uh, my mom's getting married. Nice guy. Good for her. Yeah, yeah, my brother still lives with me. Sure, we knew he wasn't going anywhere. <laughs> <clears throat> let's see, uh, my nephew's growing like a weed. My ex is getting married. I've been dating a lot, nothing serious. And as you can see, I've had a couple of mishaps. Well, except for the facial lacerations and the rectal donut, hardly noticeable. It's actually a testicular donut. What's the difference? About that much. Well, that's disturbing. Let's circle back to the ex-fiance. What was her name? Mia. Mia, how do you feel about Mia getting married and moving on with her life? I feel fine about it. I'm happy for her. No remorse, no regrets? Not really. It's been a long time. OK. So uh, when did you learn about her upcoming nuptials? I don't know, a couple of weeks ago? Yep, two weeks. <laughs> Carry the announcement around with you? Yeah, why? No reason. <laughs> and you say you've been dating a lot? Uh, a little more than usual. And when did that new pattern start? Gee, I don't know. It's got to be a couple of weeks now. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, come on, Charlie. Just because I get paid by the hour doesn't mean this should take forever. <laughs> It's pretty clear that the news about this woman getting married has hurt you, and you're acting out. Man, you shrinks want to bring everything back to feelings, don't you? Think it has anything to do with your toilet training? It, no. Well, then I guess we're stuck with feelings. <laughs> now, when you read that announcement, how did you feel? I don't know. How you feel when the woman you were once in love with is getting married to another guy? Describe it. Describe it? Just for fun. It's hard to say exactly. Uh, I, I guess it's kind of like a, 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 a trap door opens up under your feet and, and, and you're falling. And at the same time, there's this enormous pressure on your chest, like a, like a big animal, maybe a, a, a possum or a raccoon is sitting on it. <laughs> and you can't catch your breath. Possum or a raccoon? If you're writing it down, say raccoon. Will do. I don't know why I said possum. It's OK. Um, do you think it's possible that this feeling of falling in the raccoon on your chest is a physical manifestation of unexpressed grief? Grief? You know, sadness. How do you read sadness into that? Look, Charlie, you're a smart guy. Emotionally? <laughs> but you got to see what's going on here. You're using this series of meaningless sexual liaisons to run away from your feelings about losing this woman. No, no, I'm sorry. I don't see it. Let's keep looking. What about my mom getting married? That can upset a fella, right? Make him go all ancient Greek and poke his eyes out? <laughs> oh, come on, Charlie. You loved this woman. And I'd say you still love her. And deep down, maybe you were hoping someday you'd get back together. And the only reason you're not sitting here weeping is because it's too painful for you. I'm sorry. I, 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 I just can't see it. You can't see it because your penis is in the way. <laughs> Thank you. Not a compliment, Charlie. Says you. Look, you, you have a very simple choice here. You can honestly confront these emotions and learn the lessons they bring, 
or you can drive yourself into an early grave with indiscriminate sex. Define early. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. 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 Thank you.